we have breaking news out of Georgia where authorities say four people are dead and at least nine others are injured after a school shooting at Appalachie High School in Georgia. CBS reports that a suspect is in custody and students who took shelter in the football stadium are working on reuni reuniting with their families. Dave Malkoff has more from Winder, Georgia. Officials say gunfire erupted at this Georgia high school Wednesday morning. Obviously, what you see behind us uh, is an evil thing today. At about 9.30 this morning, we received the first call that there was an active shooter in this, on, on this campus. We have multiple injuries. This is a very, very fluid investigation. It's very early. The Barrow County Sheriff's Office says a suspect was taken into custody after gun violence at Appalachie High School. The great part of getting a shooter in custody is that the danger is abated and um, you can have a more methodical sort of thoughtful and slowed down process of collecting evidence. The sheriff's office said officers from multiple law enforcement agencies, fire and EMS personnel were dispatched to the school in response to the shooting. I heard like, like 12, 15 different gunshots. It was like boom, boom. Like the gunshots were so close to me, like my ears started ringing real bad. Like the whole classroom was smoking. I was in class and uh, we heard shots. The teacher ran, slammed the door, made us all go in the corner. The FBI's Atlanta office says agents are on the scene and supporting local law enforcement. During the chaos, the school with about 1,900 students was placed on lockdown. They later evacuated to the school's football field and were cleared to reunite with their families. Georgia Governor Brian Kemp says he directed all available state resources to respond to the incident. Dave Malkoff, CBS News, Winder, Georgia. And the president released this statement saying, quote, we are closely coordinating with officials at the federal, state and local level and are grateful for the first responders who brought the suspect into custody and prevented further loss of life.